to go through with you uh, proper rond de jambe technique um, so that we can improve on those, okay? So, one thing you want to make sure you're doing is um, flattening the hip in front and lifting up in front and pressing down and back. If you're doing that, then rond de jambe should be pretty easy to execute. If you're in a jelly bean form like this, with your butt out and your hips tilted up in the air like this, you're not going to be able to do rond de jambes properly, okay? So, I'm lifted in front, I'll stay this way, lifted in front here, flat here. After I do my tendu devant, I'm still lifting in my standing leg on my right side here, still lifting up, 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 still lifting up, 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 and then even more on this side, it's like I'm pulling my pant, pull, pulling my pant like that. If I don't, I'm dropping my hip and then my knee bends. If you notice on your rond de jambes that you can't close your leg without bending your knee, then your hip is drooping and that's a problem, okay? So I'm pulling up in these hips, I'm flattening them in front, I'm getting very tall on my standing leg, pulling that hip flat, pulling that hip flat, lifting, lifting, lifting as I close so I don't have to bend my knee at all. Okay, so boom, side, lift, 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 uh-oh, lift, 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 and then when I close, I'm lifting up here in the front, and then on the way, back, lift, 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 flatten my hip immediately when I take my leg side, carry it front, 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 and then I'm flattening my hip, I'm growing to close my leg, I am not slumping and bending my knee in, that's improper technique. Let's try it on the other side. One, flattening my hip. Two, flattening my hip. Three, I think flatten my hip when I close. Flatten my hip in order to close. It's not an afterthought, okay? Back, flatten my hip to take my leg side. Flatten my hip to take my leg front. Flatten, flatten, flatten to close. One more time. Front, lift, 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 and lift to close. And then flatten, close the garage door. Back, lift, 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 flatten, flatten, flatten. Grow two inches, grow two inches, okay? Practice that at home. Don't just mindlessly take your leg around. That's not a rond de jambe. It has to make a complete half a circle around from the front to the side to the back. Not kind of the front, not kind of the side. And if your leg bends, there's only right and wrong in ballet. And then it's, it's wrong if your leg bends, so you must keep it straight. If you're finding your working leg, the one doing the rond de jambe is bending, it's because you're sinking in your hips. So remember, flatten that hip in front, arrows going up, 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 up in front of you, and then down, 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 down in back of you. It should be like a constant motion if you can visualize that. Moving arrows up, moving arrows down in the back. Boom, 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 boom. It's like this never ending cycle. If you do that, you should feel tall, you should feel lifted, and all of your techniques should be great in your rondo shop. Okay, so work on that for me in the center, okay? Or if you need a bar, you can work on it uh, with the bar, but I would, um, encourage you to film yourself doing that. You don't have to worry about sending it to me, but make sure um, that you're learning how to be your own teacher. It's really important in this uh, scenario that we're in um, with everything online. So take everything I'm saying to you, take it upon yourself to film yourself. If you're serious about getting better, film yourself, okay? Watch yourself back, play it back, look at yourself objectively, that means from an outside standpoint, and say, what can I do to improve this? What has Ms. Becca told me? What can I do better to improve my rond de jambe? Not just rond de jambes, but technique in general. You can always send me a video uh, if you have questions on things you could do better. I'm more than willing to watch them, okay? Uh, but work on these at home and uh, try to be really serious about getting it right. Okay? Okay, good job today. See you guys later.